Walk on. Walk on. Walk on. Good girl. Try not to go steady and anything negative. Make it all really positive. Lovely use of open hand. Good girl. So we're here. We have Fran. There she is. Smile at the camera, Fran. <laughs> and this is Tilda. Um, Tilda's come in for uh, starting. Um, doing the rope work nice now. She's been very challenging. She's been very impatient. She's a very alpha mare. Um, and we're giving Fran a quick crash course in introducing long reining on the road. Good, a little bit of leg from your right hand. So she really could be much more forward. Yeah? Much more forward. So just use your leg. How would you use your leg? You would go... So just soften the rein and just give her a little tap with it. Yeah. Good. Perfect. Good out here, isn't she? Yeah, she loves it. All baby horses like it. See if you can get closer to her, because you're miles away again. I was just explaining to Fran why baby horses choose to be in the middle of the road um, when they're first out. And it's always because... Just ask her to halt. Excellent. Give her bum a fuss. Slide your hands up there. So she's standing on a given rein. Make sure your reins remain equal. Remain equal. Your reins are not equal. Okay, so just hold, whoa, just hold the horse and drop everything else. Hold the horse and drop all the rest of the rein. Just drop it. Yeah. Now, now pick up, put them in one hand, mm -hmm. and then just pick it all up in great big loop. Put it in the other hand. What a good girl. Good girl. I'll just give her a stroke. That's why I knew I'd get stuck with the tangling up of my legs. Good girl. Good girl. Okay. Excellent. Good. Okay, and then get yourself organised again, and off you go. You didn't tell her to go, did you? So let's bring her back to a halt. Good, now sort your reins out so they're the same length. Good girl, perfect. Okay, off you go. Walk on. Leg, leg, leg. So, a slap. Just one slap. No, not a fiddle. You're not going to fiddle with your leg. Just a walk on, that's it. You're doing very good. Ever so good. What a good girl. Now, really walking on, you'll start to realise that actually this mare really strides out. And it was only your caution in the first place that just kept her a little bit backward. This is nice. This must feel nice, yeah? Good. <clears throat> and it's adopting a walk, you know, where you put your shoulders back and your hips forward mm -hmm. so that your leg can go further. Yeah. Sometimes you see people and they're like this. Yeah. But actually the taller you make yourself and the more you push your hip forward, the easier it is for you to, um, you know, stride out. So you're going to turn right and you're going to go up to the top of this road. And after you've turned, halter. Yeah? And establish that halt up there somewhere. Walking on. Are you feeling a bit more comfortable now? Okay, so these side reins are only very loose. They're only on number seven. We never want to pull horses into a false outline, ever. We want her to walk forward, pull with a haunch outline, really loose, really nice long neck, and just feel, and again, you've got a halt here, it's a road junction. Excellent. Now, she shouldn't know how long you decide you're going to stop for. So sometimes that's a really good 